we're Darla and Mark. This is our 26 foot 2017 Sunseeker Class C that we named Serenity. We travel the U.S., work camp in the summer and usually the fall. We're amateur photographers, landscape and wildlife, who love birding, hiking, history, cemeteries, horror movies, and heavy metal music. Join us on our adventures. Really pretty cemetery. We came over, we're staying at Laura S. Walker State Park. First state park in Georgia named for a woman. And Mark looked up and she was buried here at it's a historic cemetery built in 1877, Lot Cemetery. We like cemeteries, so we came over and found her grave and we're just walking around looking at the other old graves in here. Some really pretty ones. Really old ones. And I guess because it's a swampy area, must be why some of this is... A lot of the graves are built up like that. Oh, that's a shame. The head's missing from the little angel. This is a uh, state park. It's near the Finoki Swamp. And we are going to go to the Finoki Swamp. We've been there a couple times before. We always like to go if we're near here at all. And then uh, we are probably going to make a nearly two hour drive back down to Fort Clinch because we're that close and <laughs> we just can't help ourselves. It's cold though, so I don't know how well I'm going to do at the beach when it's this cold because it is cold. It's 60s, but it does not feel 60s. It feels much colder than that. Walked back down close to where we're parked and because I saw this one I got out. This is a Jones uh, grave site and I have Joneses in my family. It's, my mom was a Jones and still have uh, an aunt and several cousins from the, from the Jones family. So I always like to uh, check these out. Never know if you might be related. So this one died in 1947 and it looks like was a I'm guessing a mason. I'm not really sure about that symbol. It's got a skull and crossbones so I don't really know what that means. But there's several in here. William Vogels Jones, J.A. Jones, and Annie Agnes S. And Lewis Ernest Royals. This is Georgia, so good possibility that some of these could be related to me. 
but I don't know for sure. Oh yeah, there's the Mason symbol. I don't know what the symbol on the other side was, but in case any of my family's watching this, Jones, here's some names for you. This is the <clears throat> lot family plot here and this cemetery is called Watt Cemetery so I don't know if it was originally maybe on their land or if they even have anything to do with the name of it but nonetheless I thought I'd get a little video of it several confederate flags most of which you can't read the um, descriptions on the graves most of them but obviously well, there's more lots down here um, obviously confederate soldiers buried here the 1885 another angel down here I have to go see another lot Dr. Daniel Lot founder of the town of Waycross ah that's why it's named Lot Cemetery died in Waycross congestion of the lungs June 24th 1880 aged 52 years 3 months and 15 days he that giveth to the poor lendeth to the Lord Beautiful angel. Might be a bit too cold for the gators to be out there. Yeah, today. that's what I need. Mean. <laughs> I need a good 70 to 80 degree day. The sun came and we were laying up on the bank. I'd like to see one. Yeah, we do. Yeah, that'll be the trail we need to be on. Okay. Boundary Georgia State Park. Let's go see what this is. Yeah. Big Creek Trail. Yeah. Nature Trail.
if you're in the geocache, there <coughs> is a geocache here in the park because we found it. <laughs> Accidentally, but we found it. and subscribe and join us next time for another adventure.